SBR Videos is sponsored by Sports Cash System. Click on the link below for more information. The East Carolina Pirates and North Carolina Tar Heels will meet up in week five of the 2013 college football season. This is Across the Board with Jeff Grant here at SBRForum.com. Saturday's opening kickoff scheduled for 1230 Eastern Time on ESPN3 from Keenan Stadium. The Tar Heels opened up as 10-point home favorites. That number has reached as high as 13 in the betting market, while the total has also been a mover from 58.5 to 61 at SBRodds.com. East Carolina 2-1 straight up, 1-2 against the spread as the program prepares to hit the road for the first time this season. The team is led by quarterback Shane Carden, who has completed 74.5% of his passes and has a 153.9 passer rating. Those are both top marks among Conference USA teams. The Pirates, though, are 0-7 straight up in their last seven road games against ACC opponents, and the team is 8-8 against the spread as underdogs the last two-plus seasons. When shifting the focus to North Carolina, as alternative wins and losses over its first three games, 3-0 three to the under. Thus far in 2013, the Tar Heels 12-2-1 straight up all-time in the series, winning the last four meetings. Quarterback Bren Renner has won his previous two starts in the series, combining to throw for 551 yards and six touchdowns. North Carolina is also 13-2 straight up in its last 15 home games, including a 7-1 mark under second-year head coach Larry Fedora, who's averaged 47.6 points per game in front of the home fans. 3-0 straight up, 2-1 against the spread versus Conference USA opponents since 2011. If you think East Carolina is going to cover this game, then I think you need to look, for the, look to the total and the over. And that's kind of the situation that I found this game to fall under, given the fact that East Carolina is 15-7 to the over in its last 22 road games. And if you like East Carolina, once again, they got to score 30 points to cover this type of number as they've had very good success when scoring 30 or more points but have failed in the fact of scoring 20 points or less. So I think there's going to be some points scored in this contest, and I think the over is the better play than, than uh, picking the underdog in this affair. So I'm going to go over 61 in Saturday's game featuring East Carolina and North Carolina. This has been another edition of Across the Board here at SBRForum.com. And you can follow me on Twitter at Jeff Grant Sports.